How about my fucking internet just keep on disconnecting? What the hell is going on? Thing down. That shouldn't. Team, tell me. There's a long update. No idea why my stream keeps fucking crashing. Nothing about the end. Or as long as I see fit. Uh. Fine. Whatever when you're gonna answer all my questions. Here, just let me know when you're ready for round two. I have to figure out how she reads people. Usually it's done by watching an opponent's behavior and facial uh, expression. Because I need to observe Hayakawa carefully while she plays poker. Hmm? Probably an earpiece. Seems like she's just playing poker, huh? Wait a second, her eyes are closed. How well does she read her opponents like that? Could try to observe her a bit more. Looks like Ayakawa hasn't been paying any attention to her opponent. She just sits there with her eyes closed. What could she be doing? Can she actually read her opponents without seeing? Hmm? Oh no, sir. Deception is out of the question. Luck was simply not on your side this time. You're fucking kidding me. Hayakawa look over at that guy before he even started flipping out. How'd she know that was going to happen? He really is reading her opponents. She has to be doing it without looking at them, right? But how? I should get out of here for now and go report to Amasawa. In fact, she knows plenty of useless trivia. Maybe she'll have an idea of, of how Hayakawa is doing. I'm guessing a camera. And a fucking electric chip in her brain or some shit. Now let's... Actually, I have no idea. Maybe in your... That, that would probably be spotted. Like, right? Alright, back to school. Tomasawa, I am coming to get information. Oh, I forgot it's already October. I should download another horror game. Or the spooky scene. Oh, this. Wait, no, I don't have to. Because I can just play something else in between. What the hell? Okay, that's enough. But now I have to think what kind of horror game would be fun out of all those that I still have. Bruh. Well, I'll look at that once it's time. Really? So it did disconnect the game. Bruh. OBS, what the fuck are you doing? Or is it just my internet? Oh! So that's back, okay. Let's finish that while we're at it. I never want to play that dumb robot game again, except for when I have to get all the parts. Still not get it. What is this? 
I specifically said. No, he's actually talking. <laughs> he was just so quiet. I didn't hear him. You're right. どうしたんだ。わかんない。車崎がまた予定と違うこと Holy shit, he needs some sleep. Gotta go after him. Are we gonna chase? Oh. No. Kurumazaki. Yagami son. Let's have a chat. I didn't think I'd ever see you lose your temper like that. Oh, no. The president's mm -hmm. right. Really? Kurumazaki kun, didn't you say you had idea? Yagami san, I'm sorry. I think I'm going to quit the robotics club. What? Why? The president's always right, and I'm just so bad at saying what I want to say. I feel like I'm at my limit. I hear you, but there's no need to do anything rash. Just take it one step at a time. Okay. Kurumazaki can really had a lot pent up inside. And even still, he never told me how he was. Guess I'll go back to the room and report. Why are we on the roof? Why are we on the opposite side of the building? What the hell? Isn't he always in that dark? I mean, he technically broke the law, even though he's a lawyer. Takamori, <laughs> もう一応。やめると言ってるんだ。仕方あるまい。今いるメンバーで何とかする。おい、おい。説得しないんですか<笑> なんかあんた。おい。どこに行くつもりだ。帰る。ちょ、ちょっと待て。お前も桜はまだまだ未熟だ。話にならない。お前がいなければ決勝で。起きてがはあんた。いとくら。俺も一抜けた。高森。車
I just came back to win the fucking thing. Hang on, me son. Itakura san came back rather suddenly. Something happened at the robotics club. Yeah, Sato. Amasawa, I hate to ask, but you think you could step up, Korsak? Of course, fine by me. Hey, Itakura. I'm not going back to the robotics club. Yeah, I get you. What Okitagawa did earlier was pretty lame. He probably deserves to be wriggling a little bit now. I get so freaking mad when I look at him now. I bet he thinks he's perfect or something. As long as everyone listens to him, he thinks everything will go just fine. That guy is hopelessly self-absorbed. I wouldn't be shocked one bit if he gets the cold show. I mean, I'd give him the cold show there too. You've done a good job of staying objective with the robotics club. You think so? In fact, I think you might be watching them as ghosts. At any rate, you know the challenges of teamwork first hand. Nah. Listen, Itakura. Even if it's from a distance, I think you can keep an eye on Okitagawa. Well, whatever the case, I have no plans on going back right now. Assholes like him need to read rock bottom once in a while for their own good. Uh. Looks like she won't be going back anytime soon. Alright, I can live with this. Now let's talk about the casino. I see. A way to read someone's emotions without looking at them. Have you ever heard of anything like this? I mean, you read a lot, don't you? I suppose. If we exclude extra sensory capabilities from the pool of possible answers, it follows that we'd be able to determine how she does it. With sight eliminated as well, we're already down to four choices. なるほど. Ah, the process of elimination. Now we're getting somewhere. Both scientists and laymen have observed how the human body releases all sorts of information unconsciously all the time. Perhaps Hayakawa-san can sense this invisible information. An unusually acute sense. Something other than sight. Yagami-san, you're the one who actually faced Hayakawa-san at the table. I'm sure you paid close attention to her. From what you've gathered, how would you surmise Hayakawa-san could be reading her opponent's mm. emotions? Okay, with a sense other than sight. Let's see. He did seem to know that one guy was going to flip his lid before he did, and she wasn't even looking at him when he noticed. People unconsciously send out information about their emotions. She must be using one of her senses to receive it. Sight? No. Hearing? I don't think so. Smell? That's what I'm... Taste? Touch. What about smell? They're invisible and you can pick them up without looking at the source. I see. Her sense of smell. Yagami-san, I'd, I'd actually read something a while back. Research was conducted that indicates dogs are capable of sensing a human's emotion based on the scent of mm -hmm. They can pick up emotions through yeah. scent. Yes, a human's hormone balance usually fluctuates as their emotions change. As a result, this, as a result, the scent of their sweat can also change to a degree. Joy, fear, sadness, surprise, impatience. Each causes human to sweat. Each causes humans. No, human sweat to smell different. Holy. How do I read this shit better when I'm drunk? Oh, lord. To the average human, these hormone fluctuations are so subtle that they would e never even notice. Dyslexia. I'm not dyslexic, dude. I used to be so good in school. And now I can't even read this shit. But dogs are said to be capable of using their sharp senses of smell to detect even the slightest change in human sweat, even from a distance. Ah, uh. uh, shut the fuck up. Wow, I had no idea. The researchers argued it could be a reason why dogs bark when they sense that their owners are uh, how they know to console depressed humans. So, are you saying Hayakawa's sense of smell is at a canine level or something? Dogs have far more olfactory receptors in their noses than humans do. 
though I doubt anyone could ever reach such a degree of sensitivity. However, that being said, there have also been reports that the number of nerve cells in charge of a human sense of smell aren't nearly as lacking when compared to those of a dog. Yeah. To sum it up, humans aren't utilizing their olfactory capabilities anywhere close to the degree that they potentially could. Somebody. It's almost as if we're locked we've locked our full potential in some. Hi. It's not outside the realm of possibility, whatever he said, okay. But casinos have all sorts of smells in them. How could she accurately pick out her opponent's stench from all the others here? I don't know. Mm. However, just like you have people with a perfect ear for discerning sound, perhaps there's also something like perfect nose. It does make the most sense with the information we've got. Sounds like a lead worth pursuing. You really are wunderkind. That trivia of yours will take you far. Holy shit, Yagami, stop using German words in the middle of your sentences. <laughs> English people, stop using German words in general. Fuck off. I'm just glad to help with the case. So does Hayakawa really have a perfect no. Sounds like the smartest theory to follow. I should see what I can find down that helped me destroy Hayakawa's sense of smell. Nah, I actually, I, I actually like it when, whenever I see a German word in some languages, it's just funny. It just feels weird for like, two seconds. Because I always have to think, does it have the same meaning? Or do they use the same word, but for a different meaning? And that's just how it is sometimes. Right, that's yeah, there. Holy shit, I'm running out of money. And I needed some to even buy the free money pass. Lord. Okay, let's let's hope that whatever we're buying is not too expensive. Perfume? Sure, let's go with that. Perfume. This should be perfect. But there are not my natural hormones with an artificial scent. Might be able to put her off the trail, so to speak. Are you? Aren't you always? Let's hope the stuff potent enough to stumber. <laughs> Bruh. Let's go with a preteen level amount. Oh, damn. Don't want my own sand sneaking in there. Ah, oh, the stench. This isn't enough to cover me up. Nothing will do. Holy shit, Yagami. You're a Jojo character. Now he only needs to remove his shirt too, and then, then he's fully completed the transformation. <laughs> Guess I'm stinking up the joint. Better make this quick. I came for a rematch. Let's play some poker. What are... Well, oh, by the look on your face, I'd say I nailed your strategy. No. Look. If you're really doing this for thrills, this should be better, even better, right? Gambling without your safety net? 
<laughs> you think you stinking at poker literally is all it'll take to beat me? Don't underestimate me, Yagami. Uh. I'm not. Now let's do this, Sayagawa. Round two. Alright, just a quick save. Ah. Alright. Let's fucking beat this child into oblivion. By beat, I mean like win ones at poker. I'm actually not allowed to fold as far as I know. That looks good. Let's just raise. Doesn't she automatically lose if I win? Or if she folds? Oh, let's go. Let's just hope we win this. You don't have a queen? Go fuck yourself. One pair. Oh, he has a queen. Damn. That was kind of close. <laughs> I lost. You remember our deal. Now let's hear it. Fine. And still, we call it. That's right. The scent of joy or sadness or fear. They all distinct and all very real to me. Even if I'm not directly looking at the source. Mm. But aren't there all sorts of smells in a casino? And other guests wearing perfume or cologne? Granted, not to the degree that Yagami san was. But with so many scents in the air, how do you ac accurately sniff out a specific person's emotion? I can see their scent. Each one gives off a different mm. color. You see smells? What do you mean? It's hard to describe it, but all the smells of the world just have certain colors attached to them in my mind. Even if I'm not facing the source, anything that I smell generates a color in my mind. Somebody. Isn't that synesthesia? Dude, as far as I know, synesthesia is a real thing, but I thought people could taste colors when reading. Or like, no. Like, no, not taste color. Fucking, uh... Taste words. That kind of thing. I think I've heard of that. Isn't it when information received by one sense gets recognized in some way by another sense? Oh yeah, basically. Eh. That one. For example, numbers generating mental color, or sounds having specific colors or smells. It's a very rare ability, though. It appears the scent information Hayakawa's son receives is also sent to the part of her brain that Okay, that's like the fourth time today. It's getting annoying. I don't know what's doing this. My internet's not this bad, or it's not supposed to be. I mean, it's not the PC, it's just the internet. It, it keeps going away for a few seconds. I don't know why. I mean, it worked for like the last few half a year or so. Without major problems. Oh, whatever. We'll have to look. Well, that's not entirely true. He also told me that all humans have synesthesia when we are still newborns. With the information you're able to pick up, I imagine telling poker hands is a lot less guesswork than it is for other people. Sounds like we found the ultimate trick in professional gambling. She sent us as colors. Hey, hey Kawasan, there's one more thing I want to ask. Did the professor assist you in getting your membership card? I've only heard the rumors about the professor. He's getting pretty well known here, but he doesn't have anything to do with this. It's actually my older brother's membership card. We may not be the same gender, but our faces are nearly identical. That's your brother. But your last name's different. 
our parents are divorced. My brother moved out with my mom, so he changed his name to my mom's main name. That's why his name is Mika... Mikitaka Makarino. So that explains it. But does that mean this case was a dead end? Nothing to do with the professor. Yeah, but Amasawa Senpai. There is one strange thing. What's strange? Well, kids who go bad, they have a certain sense to them. Like this unique blend of rage and excitement. The thing is, I've started smelling this a lot more often in the halls of Serio than I did when I first started. Ultimately, I'd be willing to bet that the scent of delinquency is spreading so quickly because of the professor. And if it's spreading across the whole city like it appears to be, then there could even be students beyond Serio that are being targeted by the professor. I know it'll sound rich coming from someone who faked their identity to gamble in a casino, but I'm no fan of the scent of delinquency. Follow that path for too long and you'll wind up with the stench of a criminal. Well, the MRC is here to help people like you find the right path before that happens. Ah. Yeah, and I'm grateful for it. Why does everything just level up at one point that I do not need anymore? Oh, lord. Okay, how far are we with this now? See no done. Anything. Yeah, robots. A robot! Yagami-san, what did Itakura say? What's no good. She doesn't want to come back. I see. Hmm. And what are we going to do for the next bet? It'll just have to be us. We're out of time and options. Well, I guess you're Yagami -san. right. Yagami-san. Preparations for the next match are complete. Please let me know when you're all set. Well, now we're just gonna lose, aren't we? On purpose? Unlock anything. Ammo, range, last wave, anchor on. Damage reduction. Care. Well, I actually don't care about this. Let's just see if we can win this like that. Sakura. Any maintenance issues to worry about? Hi. I think it's fine. Come no, no. oh, now, you sound a bit uncertain. Oh, so, Kurumazaki Senpai and Takamori Senpai aren't here, so that's true. But unfortunately, we have no other choice but to do our best with who we have. Hi. I suppose so. Round two. Now the four to lose. That first, get fucked. Yes. 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 Oh, he died. Let's go. Didn't expect him to die. Yeah. 
That's a win. Nice. Terrio Robotics Club continues as their steady push and wins the second round. They're going to the finals. Wonderful. Everything managed to work out. We have everyone in the Robotics Club who helped us so far to thank. Ah, yes. We won't move. What? Sakura, take a look. Right. And what's this? Is Serio Robotics Club having some kind of post-victory malfunction? How is it, Yagami-san? No oh, good, it's not moving. Oh, goodness. What happened here? It looks like it broke down. They may have pushed it too hard in the match. That was close. If it stopped moving in the middle of the match... And it still only upgrades the shit I already have. Bruh. Any luck with Kitagawa? Oh, he's talking. Okay, whatever. そうか。決勝戦の準備の方は、やはり決定的に戦力不足です。設計も工作もいない。それにプログラマーも。人倉先輩。Need to get Oki to go out to put. Hopefully, he sets aside his pride and apologizes. Ita, Ita, Oki Tegawa kun, Hanashi ga atta no. Okuto sensei, nan desu? Robobu, shibaraku katsuto kyushi shite morau kara. Ha? Doyu koto desu? Watashi, shirabeta no yo. Are, uso datta nda ne. Tokku ni sponsor lio wa uso. Dattara. ロボブの資金源って何なの高校生がバイトで稼げる額じゃないよねそれはそれは。それは。それは。それは。それは。それは。それは。それは。それは。それは。それは。それは。それは。それは。それは。それは。それは。それは。それは。それは。それは。それは
Yagami-san. Thank you yeah. so very much. Ayo Kitagawa. So if the sponsors already dropped that, then how are you getting funded? What did you do? If you don't share this with me, I can't defend you. My father. Your father? The one who divorced my mother. He's the CEO of an IT enterprise. He has more money than he can ever feasibly spend. Really? Cyber Complex Inc. CEO Denichiro Okitagawa. You'll find him pretty quickly if you look him up online. And why lie about still having the shopping district sponsor you? Because it's terribly frustrating to me. My parents' selfishness prevented me from entering the finals in a robot contest once before. And yet I clung to my father, trading independence for a shot at entering the tournament. <laughs> I wasn't exactly the it wasn't exactly the optimal solution. Definitely a substandard process of elimination, to say the least. Uh. I see. I guess that explains why you'd lie. Yagami-san, what should I do? Where did I go wrong? Well, Kitagawa. You need to talk to everyone. Uh. Everyone? Everyone? You've never sat down and had a real conversation with the other members. Could be that you're so talented that you never needed never. to, but you need to be more open-minded and hear out everyone's ideas. Uh. Right. You heard what Kurumazaki couldn't cry out, right? Okitagawa, has it ever crossed your mind before, listening to Kurumazaki couldn't send the other's idea? That, well, no, I don't think it ever has. And that right there is why you were lacking as the leader of the robotics club. It's true that I... Uh, that I was utterly and irrefutably wrong. Let's go talk to them. Alright. Yagami-san, the conversation is... Okitegawa is with you. Kurumazaki. Sorry. Kurumazaki. Please. I'm sorry. Can you tell me about that Okitegawa? Ah. Okay, now you just seem sarcastic, Yuki to go on. Stop it. Eh,えっと、安心しろ。俺は理解する。それじゃあ、部長、東都理科大が取ってくる作戦は。一つは徹底防御作戦。もう一つは効果力殲滅作戦。圧倒的な火力で最初にこちらの機動力を奪い、無力化。こちらの作戦で来るか。試合前日まで。だから二つの機体の同時攻撃も防御もして、スピードも基
僕も変形はやってみたかったから車崎ありがとう OK now kiss OK it o k u r a s n i g h t Moving forward, I'd like to do it myself. You sure? I am. You helped me see what I was lacking as a leader. Both you and Kurumazaki. From here on out, I want to face each member one by one. As the president of the robotics club, it's time I relieve ah. myself. Yeah, you go take care of that. The crew should be at the MRC. Understood. Till next time. Good luck with Itagawa. You're gonna have a heck of a time with Itakura and Takamori. Wonder if everything went okay with Okitakia. Well, maybe you should check on the robot. The nerd. Oh, hey, Kurumazaki. 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 Fucking uncomfortable as fuck. Bruh. Ooh. Ooh. Nah. You guys all came back? The robotics club is basically doomed without me. Isn't that right, Okitagawa? Indeed. He came crying back, so I didn't really have a choice. I was not crying. So then, you filled them in on everything. Yes, I told them about the robotics club funding and everything else. They were understanding about it. Alright then. Where are you all going now? We're going to see if we can get Akuta Sensei to reconsider disbanding the robotics club. Gotcha. Then I'll come with you. It's very encouraging to hear. You should he's rich. And that's what happened. Okay, he's talking. Okay. 